WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Tuesday, two hours left to go in the trading day. And we got a pretty flat market out there right now. S&P's flat trading at 2967. We got the Dow up four points trading at 26,721. We got the Nasdaq negative by 11 trading at 8,079. As far as the markets go, maybe everybody's already on that July 4th holiday. Gold contract, not on a holiday just yet, up $18.70 at 1408. Oil down a buck ninety at fifty seven nineteen. Notes and bonds higher price, lower yield. The ten year back under two percent. We'll pull up that chart in a moment. Ten year up fourteen ticks, one twenty eight oh four. Thirty year up a full point and two ticks, one fifty six oh two. Dollar index pulling back one hundred and sixty nine ticks at ninety six two forty. And Bitcoin back above ten thousand ten thousand seven fifteen. We'll start things off, and we're going to start it off with the chart of that ten year. There's your chart of the ten year yield. That is some volatility, folks. You were up at about 2.05% end of the day yesterday. Right now, you're sitting at a 1.979 10-year yield. Pretty remarkable. Let's jump over to the future markets. We'll jump over to the Dow. And we're a uh, little bit of volatility in both directions today, but all things considered, pretty tight trading range. We're about 100 points from low to high, maybe even 90 in the Dow. Approaching the upper end as we speak, trading 26,710. NASDAQ 100, 77.91 was about 20 points lower just about an hour ago. S&Ps, a little bit of volatility in both directions as well, trading 29.67. We reached a low of 29.59 about an hour and a half ago. There's your crude contract, quite a trade to the downside. Just last night, we were up there trading at 59.37. We almost dropped a full $3 just from last night, let alone you back this up to yesterday morning. We're back, we're above $60. You have crude trading at 57.18. Gold contract, quite an acceleration. The run really begins at about 10 a.m. at 13.93. We're trading at 14.8. You back this up a little bit further. End of the day yesterday, we're sitting at 13.86. So quite an acceleration to the upside for gold. And euro U.S. dollar trading right under 113, 112.97. Stay tuned, folks. We're going to man Dave White coming up with the Power Trading Hour live from 2 till 3. Of course, Tom O'Brien wraps it up from 3 till 5. Market's pretty flat. We'll see what happens. And uh, as we wrap it up, something to keep your eye on here is uh, President Pence canceling a trip to New Hampshire. He was in flight, heading back to the White House. Maybe we'll see some headlines, something going on. Stay tuned. Steve Rhodes coming up right now. Ah, Dave White right now.